officially trying to start that box braid. Um, I originally split it in half because I was going to um, try to do not as y'all can see, I have my hair already parted. Not it's have to use a rubber band. I use this Bella Curl. And that Bella Curl is dry. So, Sorry I am to all to my try. Bella fans. I did this, not like it. But this I love like snot, this it says. cream of so I'm nature. I'm thinking it might have the same snot. texture as the And uh, you see my nails are super glue, long. Which I don't like because it's sticky. Like, so, it's not as sticky as that. So, let's see what it's going to do. A little bit, so. Ooh, it already feels good so this is how i'm gonna do this braid ladies so i am going to i already parted my hair in four sections i've moisturized i put oil in it i will show you guys the oil in just a minute and as you can see i have claws on for nails so what i'm gonna do is i have this piece already here and i'm gonna split this right down the middle like this to open up a piece in the middle. This is for my friends who don't know how to do braids or they got real long nails or you a beginner like me. Hold on, I got a piece of hair out that I didn't put in. Okay. And it is noise in the background. Y'all know that I got my kiddos. I will introduce them in another video. I got three here with me today. Plus my husband. He'll be on here one day too, hopefully. Okay, so I am going to attempt to do this style y'all because heaven knows i don't know how to do this so here we go right now i have some hair i have the pre-stretched cacalon hair that i got from the beauty supply nothing too fancy i got a three pack though because you actually get three um like at this point i'm about to and one really pack. not be able to and hook it's way cheaper that way and so, so I got my hair split in the middle. And actually started. And I'm gonna put this braid doing a rubber band in the middle because it was just too slippery and I cannot wrap my hand around it. So this video is not about a knotless braid. It actually has a we knot. Step, and for those long claw nails, that was way easier to do, y'all. So Harlem, go in there. Oh, that's me grabbing my rubber band. That's my. Cause I am not having work. it. It's horrible. Anyway. Bonus baby. Um, I'll introduce all of those in the future. So I got a little bit of this snot in here, y'all. And I didn't get my edges all the way right. But I'm going to try to get them right on the next part that I do. Okay. So let's see how we doing here. So it feels really good so far. So I got about that much hair, y'all, and I'm gonna see if I can get this on her with my long nails. So here we go. See how I do. First braid, first time, beginner. Oh, what's going on? I may wear some gloves next time or either put some band-aids on my nails just to cover up my rhinestones because they they are getting tangled in my hair if y'all can see that i know the lighting is horrible so hopefully when i edit this thing it looks a lot better okay not too bad pretty good grip on it like i said um definitely will recommend you put a whole lot of edge control on this so probably when i edit this for my next braid I'm actually going to start this one over, y'all, because I want to put some more edge control on my hair. But you can see the texture on the hair that already got, like, snot on it. It's already looking good. All right. So I will come back after I start braiding to show y'all kind of how I braid. I'm just going to put some more edge control on this and replat this braid. I really wish um, that would have went as fast as it looks on the picture. My arms were dead at that point. I was like, oh my God, why did I put so many braids in my hair? So I'm just like, wow. Never again. I think I'm going to do them like really jumbo. And that's what I kind of meant. But once I start partying and trying to grab all the hair, I was just like, 